Uh, 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 Dad! Dad! Uh, have you been here all night? Mm. Oh gosh, should I call an ambulance? Uh, huh? Okay, no. No, you need water, not an ambulance. No, this is doing me very nicely, thank you. I thought we were over this. Mm. What happened? Was it the letter? It was Serge. Who's Serge? A roofer, apparently. From Brussels. Ronnie's new man. What kind of example is this? Nothing happened. Yeah. Stayed over on a first date. Mm. Yeah, there. Fell asleep after two beers. Well, did you chew his ear off about scrap? No. Cars? No. Yeah, a bit. He's not into him. Well, you made him watch Top Gear, didn't you? Just when he nodded off. He even fit when he snores. Did you get a snog? As if I told you if I did. <laughs> Hiya. Oh, God. I'm so sorry. Don't be. You're sorry for boring you to death. No, it was me. I came for a 12-hour shift right before the barbecue. It's a junior doctor thing. I should have warned you. Don't worry about it. When's your next one? What? Shift. Oh, not today, thankfully. Well, you can stay for breakfast, then. I'll meet you both for breakfast. Drink it. Ugh. We're looking for a place to do up together in Bruges. Serge wants to adopt a couple of dogs. Perhaps you could try being happy for him. Happy for who? Ronnie. He's found love on a Flemish building site. He sent a letter. So obviously, he hit the bottle. Not again. I've got this investors meeting today. I'm supposed to be staying over. Can you keep an eye on him? How many more times we do not need an investor? Our turnovers beg to differ. It's too late to cancel. Yeah, fine. Don't let him drink. Do not let him anywhere near the car keys. Don't feed him after midnight. I'm still here, you know. Hopefully he'll calm down once it's sunk in. Go. Have a good first day back and try and eat something healthy, yeah? It's not going to impress him. He's already seen me on a drip. No, no. Hiya. Oh. Brilliant. That's great. Excellent. How was it? Not that. You know what I mean. I'll see you on the way to school. You're giving me a little number. Holy. I think they might like you. I'm sensing you're not as keen. What? Well, I don't know. I mean, I don't really know you yet, do I? It's my fault. Why don't you wake me up? You look like you needed it. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> no, I mean, you looked peaceful or whatever. You watch me sleep. That's not creepy at all. <laughs> well, stay conscious next time, then. I'm free now. Can give it a go. Uh, well, I've, I've got to work. Cool. Meet you for lunch. I could just take the hint. No, that'd be good. Lunch would be good. See ya. See ya. Should you be halfway to Newcastle? I'm thinking about rain checking. Dad's gone into meltdown. Well, it'll be worse when the whole business folds. It's not the investment, it's Ronnie. He wrote to say he's got a new boyfriend. Seriously? Dad's a wreck again. And Lachlan's not exactly the greatest babysitter. So. Well, I suppose I could check in on him if you want. Uh, I'm not sure the truce would survive it. He's in a foul mood. Yeah, so am I. Live again? No, Aaron. He's dating someone. I saw them together yesterday. <sighs> I'm so sorry. It'd be good to take my mind off it, to be honest. Not by listening to my dad rant about Serge. Serge? He can fill you in. Don't let him anywhere near the office, though. I've stashed all the spirits in my desk. <laughs> so I'm on babysitting duty. If you're sure you don't mind. No, I don't mind. Thank you. And, um, wish me luck. You won't need it. 